Hi, today we're going to talk about the Stephen Hall architect. Stephen Hall is one of the most famous architects in the world, as well as a researcher and a practitioner of phenomenological architecture. He has won almost every architectural award in the world. At night of, on 9 of December 1947, Stephen Hall was born in Bremerton, Washington in USA. After graduating from the University of Washington College and of Built Environment in 1970, Stephen Hall went overseas to study architecture in Rome. Six years later, he entered the Architectural Association in London as a graduate student. In addition, he also opened his own studio. For the first 10 years after living in New York, he lived in his studio every day, even eating, sleeping. In 19, 1981, Stephen Hall went to Columbia University as a teacher. Initially, Stephen Hall aspired to the type of architecture technology, okay, but later in his contact with the philosopher, Maurice Muller Fonti and the architectural theorist Johanny Parasma. After that, his architectural truth has undergone great change. He began to yearn from phenomenology architecture. Phenomenology architecture is a concept that considers the existence of people and the contact between people and things around them. There are many buildings designed by Stephen Hall, such as the Art Museum in Nanjing, China, and the Simon Hall in USA, and the MoMA in Beijing. MoMA also called as a link hybrid. Okay, so today we are going to talk about the MoMA building designed by Stephen Hall. MoMA located in Dongcheng District, Beijing, is a project developed by China Contemporary Real Estate Company. This project is designed by the famous New York-based architect Stephen Hall. The project is to create a collective housing. A lot of functions are included in this building, such as cinema, gym room, coffee shop, hotel, and even kindergarten. Just like the Chinese saying, the style is more, it has all five chapters. The total length area of this project reached 221,000 square meters. A total of 9 buildings of different height have been built in this project. Between 14 and 19 floors of each building, they will have a bridge connected to the building next door, which looks like a ring connecting the 9 buildings. Uh, Stephen Ho also designed the project as a larger scale greenhouse and he incorporated many plants into the project. It is located outside the northeast corner of the second ring road in Beijing and is adjacent to the MoMA of the airport expressway on the south side. Before the MoMA project was developed, the place was the first paper mill in Beijing. The design of this project is inspired by the painting Dance by the French painter Henri Matisse. In this painting, there are five people dancing together holding hands. This painting looks like a prehistoric era with primitive people around the fire, holding hands and dancing together, living an unrestrained life. It also looked like a, looked like a ring connect, connect the five together. So after Stephen Ho design and change, it, become, it became a project of nine buildings connected by bridge. In the middle of the nine buildings, Stephen Hall designed a pool in which he designed a small hotel and a cinema. Those nine connected buildings become a passage to form and form the center pool. When people only see nine tall buildings from the outside to enter the central hotel and cinema, it's like entering a city within a city. One of the highlights of Beijing contemporary moment in the corridor on the 14th to 19th floor. Uh, Stephen Hall designed daily swimming pool, gym, gym room, cafe and other corridors at this height, allow, allowing people to have different experiences. Uh, that's all for today. Thank you.